Okay, so here's your update for this week. We did fall a week behind. It didn't hurt much. It's not going to hurt much. Um, it's going to take the first week of March to catch it up, but uh, beautification and stuff's not going to take the full month. Um, there's been a lot that's been done. I know you're probably looking. Uh, it won't let you see it. Let me see. There you go. All right, so um, this week was, you know, connecting in the objectives uh, through code, stuff like that, um, stuff of that nature, and I just wanted to go through and show you guys. Uh, there has been what's called the SOP training manager uh, script. It's going to run the actual training uh, that's been worked on. It will actually go through connecting the hose, and all of this stuff right here uh, that you see will be tested. Now, um, it, and it's already been tested to work. That's what it's showing in here. Now, um, but it, it will break because obviously it's, it's still got a little bit of code to go, which is what I'm going to use the first week of March to tie in. Uh, anyway, so uh, what we're going to do is we're going to, I'm going to run a, a tester uh, script in the background that's obviously it's going to be set up a certain way. Uh, none of the actual parameters are going to be shown. It's just stuff for the demo. It's stuff that I'll know what to do to show a pass or fail uh, when we do the demo. Now, to, you know, and maybe some experienced firefighter, if they get under the hood for the demo, if they get under the hood for the demo, uh, maybe they can run one and, and maybe they can see if they can pass or fail. I'll put it as something like look at the smoke or uh, it's, 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 it's very, it's quite simple. Um, anyway, so I have created, I've done that and I have created the, this runs the text for the trainer, uh, on the inside. Uh, obviously it's just, uh, dealing with the, the beginning of the training and stuff, um, for now, but this is uh, some more code that has been implemented uh, since uh, since our last update. Uh, same as the SOP training manager. Um, now, the last time we talked, we were discussing the firefighter. I have finished all of his code. Uh, well, most of it anyway. You know, I've got to set up certain things for the objectives, but all of his basic uh, movements and stuff no longer glitches out, bugs out. Um, anything of that nature like it did in the video on the last one. Um, remember I said in the video I had to add a little more code. Well, it's all been added. And um, so right now everything is looking good. Now, what it's going to go to, let me change the screen back again. Uh, you guys don't want to see all that code. Is it going to work? Yes, there it is. All right, so um, we're still running at a good... In an idle state, 314 frames per second, if, um, which is because I've got the awake stuff going in. Um, if we, when we run, it does run at 97 frames per second, so I've added a few frames uh, just fooling around with the smoke and stuff. So the objectives that we are going to clear, all right, are going to, uh, which they're already, hand, they're already coded in, uh, I'll run a, when I run the video, I'm just going to run the video so I can show you guys some things. Uh, like I said, if I run through the, cur all the objectives, it will break right now. Uh, first week of March. All right, so, <clears throat> uh, but the first one, you start looking at him coming out of here. You guys, he says, connect the hose. You run over here, training begins, connect the hose. Both of you are going to come over here. He's going to crouch. Uh, and then connect once the hose is connected, it'll swap you to the 360 cordon uh, going around the house. Now, uh, that's where I'm going to start. I'll, I'll add a test here as far as twisting the hose uh, just for now, just for the demo. That's where the test is going to be on that. And then going around here, I've, I've got smoke up inside of coming out of the roof as well as light coming through from the fire and embers and stuff like that. When they're doing the 360 cordon, they need to take a look, you know, make sure they're looking for smoke coming out of the building while they're doing it. Obviously, with the smoke here, they've got to look up, and then that's what that's going to test for. Now, I don't have, I don't, it's not telling them, it's just telling them, three, you know, do a 360. All right. Then, obviously, you go all the way around, which that's what all those red parts are. And, um, 
Next thing is making entry. I've got the door out for now. Um, it's, it's on a code to where he will knock it open and you will come in. There's not really any too much I can test for on that. Maybe if there's more than two characters, because I know the, the, I, was, I believe I was told the firefighters do two on two. But there's no need for that now because there's no more than two characters inside of the scene. All right. So I then inside, it's going to be clearing the house and clear and assess is the actual objective name. Um, and you go through, hit all the rooms, all that good nonsense. Uh, look for the fire, blah, blah, blah. If you don't hit all the rooms maybe set, and set security on the fire here, uh, then it's that's where the test is going to lie that make sure all the rooms are clear the companion only goes to into here and and little i mean I'm, I'm telling them to do the clear and assess but i'm not telling them how to do it the companion will go in here and actually is, be stand the guard over the fire and, and assess it you have to clear the house now he's gonna he, he's gonna go through as well but the, the character must as well anyway um and he already does all that, which I'm going to show you in a second. Now, um, the fire. Oh, and then once you got to put it out and pure pre and positive pressure to re re get relieve the smoke is going to be the the final objective once you guys clear and assess. So that's uh, the five objectives that we're going to do. Once again, it's going to be connect hose, uh, cordon on the house, make entry. Clear and assess, uh, and the last one is clear hazard, meaning, you know, put the fire out. Now, the fire that I'm going with is this one. The smoke that I'm going with are these. All right, one's lighter than the other, as you can tell. And then I've got the smoke out here on the roof as well, like, like I said previously. Now... that's how all that's going to work obviously it's going to you know by the time uh april one is here all of it's going to be pretty all of it's going to be tied in together and finished off um but this is this is our rough this is what it is our rough prototype all right so uh let's let's go down again to the companion i want to finish showing off what all has been done so let me close all these. These are all those things I've got to mess with during code. All right, so we're going to, I've, you got to excuse me. I've got the headset on top of my head with the earphones in. I probably look like a crazy man right now. So we're gonna, just going to try and see if we can see. Now see, yeah, okay, we can see. Now, if you see here, we're actually running a little better than 97 frames per second right now. We're running more like 98. All right, so uh, we're doing pretty good. Now, I come in here. Remember last time he'd mess up? Well, he doesn't mess up anymore. So he's going to go for the yard waypoints. Or we can tell him, hey, stop. Come back for the house waypoints. All right, he said no. You're going to stop him. House. And he's going to come back. Or he's going to go around. So you got to remember he finds the, there he is. He's got to find the perfect, his perfect preferred path through mathematical equations now uh we can stop him again and we can have him come back and go to the hydrant which oh god i can't see it's pretty it's like i said i'm not using any controllers or anything let me try there we go i just had to turn him on oh he's already over there wow he got there pretty quick um, but yeah, he's, he's ready for you to connect the hose. So, um, like I said, all of his glitches and bugs have been worked out. That's another good thing that has happened in the past week with, uh, you know, everything's been going on and stuff. Now, um, now also we're going to, now we're going to go into the SOP training manager. Okay. Now, um, right now when you start it, uh, like I said, it's got to get tied in. So all it does right now is this, but with, through the code, obviously, with the little checkbox right here, it'll start. Training begins, which that's what happens when you enter. Connect hose. He's going to come over here. That hose placeholder's right there. Um, I'm not going to hit the other objective. Like I said, it'll break. 
uh, right now. But he'll put or you'll put that in, twist it, and then it'll go on. All right. So the rest is like I said, March one. I'm or Mar the first week of March. I'm going to finish out the rest of the code to go around. Uh, finish out the rough skeleton uh, of the prototype, which this is the prototype. Uh, you got to remember it's going to flow from the beginning where it shows all the flames, the water going on it with uh, the name and all that stuff. And then it flows into the um, the fire station, I'm sorry, uh, with the headset training and then all that. Then it flows into the objective here. And, uh, and then from the objective, it flows into the testing screen. So, uh, which the testing screen's already built up and ready i've just got to uh, connect the sop training manager to the tester and go from there that's something like i said will take place uh the first week of march now uh from the second week of march to the first week of april it's, it's going to be the beautification process i'm going to add loading screens i'm going to add you know just little things that were not prime you know primary things um like I said, the, the primary skeleton or primary skeleton skeletal prototype without the beautification will be done uh, the first week of March. Uh, after beautification, April 1, we'll start writing the pitch and then we'll be ready May uh, to go. Now, that just because we're, we're writing the pitch doesn't mean I won't be constantly tweaking and uh, turning, you know, uh, uh, variables and, and, and tweaking parameters and <clears throat> moving things around and stuff of that nature. Uh, beautification does entail all that, as well as making everything, you know, set in stone, every, well, yeah, pretty much set in stone, and making everything look uh, just how you want it, you know, to finish looking. Now, um, if there's any questions, I'm sure there are some. If not, uh, you know, the... At to the first week of March, end of the, the end of the first week of March, it'll all be pretty much you know right there because you'll be able to see the final skeletal structure. Uh, but as far as the beautification, that'll be April one. That'll be pretty much the hey, this is the I would say beta version of the demo because gold you know will be right before we. Uh, you know, initiate the pitch. So, um, any bitches, moans, gripes, complaints, concerns, whatever, uh, give me a call, shout, Facebook, whatever you got to do. Uh, thank you. Have a great weekend and uh, looking forward to the finished skeletal product at the end of March, the first week of March. All right. Appreciate it, guys. Good night.